Hello and welcome to this week's Indie Showcase. Today we are playing the demo of a game called While the Iron's Hot. This is developed by Bon Temps Games and it releases on the 5th of December, so very soon at the time of this video's release, like the next week. So, this I'm expecting a crafting game, but that's kind of all I really know. I don't know how much kind of simulation's gonna be in it, how like Saju compared to anything else, I don't know. So we should just jump in and see uh, what we get from Wild the Iron Sun. Uh, I do love like trying to find my perfect crafting game. So we'll see if this is it. Hey, Luca. Dry stun. Time to wake up. Come outside when you've got your feet under you. There's some work to do. All right, tutorial movement and interactions. Your energy gets depleted over time. Make sure you keep an eye on it or you will pass out and have to pay someone to bring you back to safety. Okay, okay, so let's not pass out then. That would be terrible. So this is our energy here, I guess. Time of day, money. Time to get to work. Use the door to exit your house. Let's see what we've got. What about fashion though? Oh, it's a safe and we have nothing in it. <laughs> okay. Never mind. Let's get to work. Ah, Luca. The prince has risen. Har har. Slept well? <laughs> I'm sure when when, <laughs> when har har's written like that, you're not supposed to say it the way I say it. But I don't know how it actually sounds. So I just say har har. <laughs> Oh, very funny. Yes, what's on the agenda? Well, first we need to... Was that a deer person? First we need to replenish our stock of resources. There's a mine east of here, but you need to get yourself a pickaxe before going. So are we going to be collecting our own resources and then making things out of them? Is that a squirrel person? There's the antlers, I think. Okay. <coughs> And you don't have an old one I could just borrow? Come on now. It'll be a good warm-up to get you started. Here, take these resources. It's all we've got left, but it should be enough to make a pickaxe. So don't mess it up. Smelt the ore. Mold the ingots on your anvil. Sharpen them on the grindstone. Put it all together on your work table. Wait a second. That's four whole steps here. Let me get this straight. Smelt it. Mold it. On the anvil. Sharpen on the grindstone. Okay, put it all together on the way. Okay, I gotcha. It's <laughs> a lot of instructions. Easy. And if you have trouble, here's a schematic showing you how to assemble a pickaxe. Okay, cool. We got a schematic somewhere. We got some resources. Uh, time to get to work. Enter the forge and interact with the smelter to melt six iron ore. So yeah, this seems like a journal. Uh, telling us the details. C. Codex. Uh, R. Wood. Axe. No, pickaxe, sorry. Okay. Oh, look. Uh oh. Is that how we assemble it on the work table or something? Cool, cool, okay. And then we've got inventory. Here's the schematic. Right. Let's follow along and do what it says. Upgrade your forge to craft items more efficiently. Well, I don't think I'm going to be upgrading it yet, right? We need to smelt first. Aha, uh -huh. the exclamation mark might give it away. Help! Press the uh, press to select one from the stack. Hold to select a hold stack. The whole stack. Press to remove one item from the selection. Hold to deselect everything. Okay. I think I understand. I need to feel this to actually understand it though. Um, press to destroy selected or held item. Oh, oh, hold on. F, E, and R. Uh oh. Well, we'll figure it out. <coughs> so, F, hold F to select the entire stack. Oh, seems good, right? Can we not just like left click and right click it? No. That's okay. I was trying to press E to see if that took them back. Smelt is going to take one energy. 
Tutorial Smelter. The smelter does not require your assistance to transform ore into ingots. However, you can speed up the process by interacting with the lever next to it. Okay, so it can just chug away by itself or you can speed it up with a mini game. Uh, lever. Oh, is it like a time and mini game? Cool, cool, cool. Wait, eight? Cool. We we multiply. Now we need to mold it on the anvil. Iron curved plates. I guess that's probably all we know how to do right now. And we need two of them, right? Uh oh. Right, so we've selected iron curved plates. One times two. So is that gonna give me two? Or is that like one times two squares? <laughs> Let's just press mold and see what happens. I don't know how many I'm making. Hammer on the pieces outside of the green border to make the hot ingot match the shape. Okay. Interact with the anvil to forge two. Oh yeah, yeah. So like, uh oh. Oh god. Oh, interesting. Cool. Uh, we did it! Did that only give us one though? That only gave us one. My bad. Oh! And if we get... Okay, if we get the one closer then the rest of them vanishes too. Seems good. Interact with the grindstone to sharpen the plates. Oh yeah, because they're just like big hunks of metal right now. Press F to select yeah press f to select one from the stack oh yeah same thing so just don't press r really okay hold f to oh that's d my bad hold f to do the entire stack grind uh watch the timing to press the directional input that matches the lit arrow all right uh using it as d Wazdi with with the W as well. Yes. Oh, I'm so good at blacksmithing. Basically, a professional at the at the moment. Uh, interact with your work table to assemble the pickaxe. Uh, same thing. Right. <laughs> pickaxe assemble. Here we go, so we can enter our codex here and that tells us here. I assume we've got a copy. So it would be like this, 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 this. That's pretty cool. Because then imagine you've got all sorts of different stuff and you're going to try and maximize what you can make out of it. Stack items to create bulk quantities. Oh cool, so you can make many at the same time. Right, well this looks Right, does it not hold E to assemble? Oh god. Yay! We got it. Yay, we got it! It's purple. Return to dry stand. I wonder if that means handmade or something. The pickaxe you requested is complete. Oh my eye, I can hardly look at its beauty. Shame you'll have to scuff it digging for materials. Exit the village and go east. You'll stumble upon a mine and it should have plenty of ore. I better get going then. It's already night time. It took me the entire day to make. Unless it was already night time before. But I just woke up, didn't I? It was all day to make this um, pickaxe. Do you want to leave the scene and go to the world map? Okay. Set east for the mine. Uh, each step will decrease your energy by different amounts based on how strenuous the terrain is. Okay. Oh, we got some fog of war. <laughs> Stocking up. Travel east to the mine. Alright, let's go. Uh, oh. Uh oh. Oh, no. I didn't realize I was controlling my character cell. <gasps> <clears throat> I see a treasure chest down here, but 
I need to chop a tree down or I'll go wandering. I think I should follow the tutorial. I don't know why I was missing a key item there. I love that little icon, the loading with the grindstone. Uh, right, stocking up, gather the iron ore. Yeah, still the same thing. Oh, there's no lights on, I don't like that. Hopefully it's not haunted in here. I'm hoping for nice mine. <laughs> I like that we're just carrying our pickaxe in our apron pouch. That's really adorable. Yes, we took all the iron off that rock. Cool. Oh, we got quite a lot there, eh? 30? Turn to the forge. Should I get another one while I'm here? Seems sufficient. What's in here? Oh, we can't. This bridge looks like it could use some work. <laughs> Ah, you the sneaky Sam. What are you doing here? It is haunted by sneaky Sam. I'm just collecting some more. Oh god, leave me alone, sneaky Sam. You shouldn't be here. Who sent you? Who do you work for? Why are you jewel wielding knives? Please, no one send me. Let's just calm down. I can explain. The bridge is gonna collapse. Ah, I'm a sneaky brother. We don't know calm, only chaos and you. You've seen too much. I've seen all, that's all. This is crazy, just wait. Oh no. I knew it. <laughs> ah! Goddamn bridge, I told you I needed some work. Ouch, everything hurts. That old br bridge was only meant for one person. Feeling good, pretty good about my London spot right now. Yikes. I should try to find my way out, especially before one of his bandit friends comes looking. Is he dead? Oh, what did I just pick up from him? Letter to Sneaky Sam. Can I read it? Oh. <coughs> Dear Sneaky Sam. How many times do I have to send this to you? Your oath to the Sneaky Society is never ending. Can we join the Sneaky Society? So there is no need to remove your ring. I'm tired of making you a new one, so find it. It has to be laying around that cave of yours. If you can't, you won't be able to gain access to our secrets. And my man won't deliver you the loot anymore. You will find the code to your share of the last job at the bottom of the letter. Good thieving and may bad deeds be with you. Lovey. Okay. The code to get the share of the last job. Okay, so I have to click on the blueprint to activate it. Cool, cool. Well, sneaky Sam. Rip. Whoa, we are an agile blacksmith. Uh, we don't even have an up jump. We can only dive and roll. I mean, it's the best way to protect yourself, I guess. I'm falling. You gotta roll. Find a way out of this abandoned mine. Well, this isn't what I was expecting. I would like a grapple hook or something to go and get that treasure. Hope we don't pass out before we make it out. So we have to hire someone to bring us home. So it looks like we could climb up there. I feel like I should be collecting this. Can we collect these mushrooms? Ooh, hold on. Like, think of all the things we can make. Oh, what did we just collect? I see bones. Iron plates. Oh, nice. I thought it was like some sort of anchor point. Never mind. Right. Oops, how are we gonna get up there? Maybe this wall can crumble? Why are there so many skulls down here? Are they all members of the oh, sneaky society? Oh, can I maybe use this crate? 
here. Can I pull it? This is pretty good. Like, I like all the animations and stuff. I've got to remember not to jump. I press up to climb, not jump. Alright, yeah, I got an idea. If I jump over here, pickaxe this. And reap the rewards. Oh! Lovey! Oh, imagine if it just exploded because I got it wrong. Whoa! This is so much stuff! Goggles! A set of nails recipe, iron hammer recipe, iron axe, spatula, iron knife. Oh, we could make an iron knife right now. Sneaky Sam had two of those. We could make an iron axe right now. I get, guess we can probably make iron ore or iron ingots into iron plates at home at least. Nails. What are these little rods? Oh, we couldn't make this. This is like a giant plate. And a spatula. Okay. Why do we need a spatula? Oh god, right, I want to take everything. Oh, hinges, money, oh, a coin purse. A purse full of coins, add 50 coins to your total. Oh, I thought it was saying we could carry more coins. I mean, I'm taking it all. Right, hold on. Does this stack? It does. Oh, I love stacks. Oh, beautiful. I like it when it goes to more than 10 as well. Oh, beautiful. Right, oh man. Do I need to organize this? Because like, it should be like tools, right? Oh god. Tools, metals. Uh, this letter here. Crafting stuff here resources can i wear this a pair of protective goggles can be gifted to a friend but can i not give them to my eyes please <clears throat> that was such a good haul i mean i presume i don't know the economy yet but it felt good what is this a box of light oh screws and bolts a pack of screws and bolts that are to hold objects together Right, we are gonna craft our way out of this... I was gonna say prison. We're not in prison. And then I was gonna say dungeon, and I don't think we're in a dungeon either. What are we in right now? Mineshaft? Gonna craft our way out of this shaft. <laughs> you can't get shaft without craft. Except you totally can, but you know. Oh! Okay, so to... To repair this lift, we needed an iron plate, two by one, uh, two hinges, and four screws and bolts, and we found all of those things. Oh, so everyone had to find that stuff. I thought I was being so, like, thorough and clever finding the treasure. <laughs> I know, it, it wasn't exactly difficult. Oh, let me off, let me off! Okay, yeah, I wanted to find what was in this box. I was going to jump off Dark Souls style. But then I just get. A sneaky ring. A ring that pro- Oh, this is Sneaky Sam's ring that he lost. That pro proves your allegiance to the Sneaky Society. I've accidentally joined the Sneaky Society. I got what I wished for. Can we keep going up? Oh. Uh-oh. We've got to go all the way back down. I wondered if there was a secret up one more time, but there wasn't. Okay, let's go. Well, let's see where this brings us out at. Do we have a map? We can access the world map in places. <coughs> oh, here it is. Yeah, please. Thank you. 
uh, world map interactions. Interact with certain tiles and use the tools you forge to create new paths and opportunities. Well, we have an axe now, right? So... Oh, we have to have the axe to get out. This is cool progression, like natural. Oh, I don't think I need to get it out. I think it, the game now knows. Oh, lovely. Okay. And now we can... Nope, we do not need to enter that mine again. But we still have energy. So why don't we... We should also collect some wood from this, right? Yeah. Oh, it looks like our axe maybe has durability as well. Oh, wow, so much stuff. A chain. Schematic showing you how to assemble specific items. Yeah, yeah. A chain. Like link things. Chain links. A sword. Uh, and a hatchet. What's a hatchet for? Is that a weapon? A cast iron skillet pan. Definitely use that as a weapon. And iron sword. Yeah, look, um, you can see the durability, which obviously makes sense in a crafting game, to be fair. Uh, oh, we got more money. I'm so rich. We got more iron. Like, we have so much iron right now, we could just sleep in it. Like, use it as a bed. Uh, a sword. And then enchanted wood. An enchanted piece of wood originated from Toot Swamp can hold eternal flame. Oh, so it's like ever lit? That's pretty cool. Okay, that's empty now, but I see there's a beach over here. Now I'm just gonna use all my energy because I feel like I'm gonna be going to sleep, you know? Oh, this has got a lot of elements in games that I like. It, exploration. Like, I quite like the little mini games so far. Uh, resource gathering. Oh, I like it so far. Which... Are these both the same? There's two different houses here. Oh, we're so tired. That's my bad. Is this... Oh my goodness. House, forge, stables. We have so many coins. We could totally... We have an enchanted ember flame, right? Not ember, just enchanted wood. Oh, we already have a forge number two anyway, it seems. Oh, we got a schematic for chains. Oh, we already have a house number two though, right? Adds a big closet for unlimited storage space. Unlimited storage space? That is so essential in a crafting game for me. I think we need to, like, can we make it to, oh, dry stun? I nearly called him cap stun. Can we make it to dry stun before we pass out? I think we should go to sleep first. I'm glad this was our house. I wasn't, like, 100% sure. Oh, no, I can't sleep. I'm going to pass out and have to spend my money. Oh, walking around. Yes, it is. Dry stun, stop running away. Whoa, what happened to you? You should see the other guy. <laughs> yeah, he's dead. What other guy? What have you been up to, kid? A thief got angry. I was gathering ore in there. We ended up breaking the old bridge and falling to the lower levels of the mine. Well, you're gonna need rest after this adventure. Overextension will make you pass out. Yeah, no shit. I'm like seven steps away from passing out. Come find me when you've had the chance to recover. I have an order you like to hear about. Oh god. You can do it, Luca. Oh, there's a seat there. Okay, it doesn't go that quickly, so that's fine. When do you want to sleep? Until morning or until night? Until morning, I guess. An entire 24 hours sounds good. Clouds lifted. Tiles parkoured. Okay, hold on. Characters met. Three. Oh no! Oh, there we go. Oh, it's like the scrolly wasn't working. I have to use WASD. Tiles parkoured. I guess that's something different to what I'm thinking that means. 
items crafted, all this fulfilled, mini games done. So it's really keeping track of what you're doing. Oh, we're so close to leveling up. Tomorrow, for sure. <clears throat> right. Dry stand, I'm ready for the order. I feel great. Good call on resting. What's that order you mentioned? It's a notice board in Strom, the lumberjack's village east of here. It's broke. Myrtle requested a hammer and some nails so that other people can fix it. Alright, I should have enough resources to make that for us. I suggest you complete this order fast so that Strom can get back to posting orders for us. I'll make it my priority. So they want a hammer and some nails? Iron hammer and a set of nails. Using the schematic dry stand gave us. Did we not already have this? Don't know. Let's see. Codex would be the one, eh? An iron hammer. What does that hatchet do? Is it just a small axe? Hmm. Dry stand hasn't given me. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yes. One iron plate, two by two. And a wood. And nails. Where are nails? Set of nails. Three iron sharpened strips. So I guess we should make the iron strips on here. So we need three of them. Oh, whoops. Yeah, no. I don't know why I'm whoopsing. Got it. So did that give me three strips? It did. So then I, if I sharpen them, they'll be sharpened strips. And then that should make the nails, right? <coughs> I like how quick the minigames are. Uh, keeps you going. A T-shaped tool used... Oh, that's a, <laughs> a small iron sharpened strip. A small strip of iron that has been sharpened. Useful as a toothpick. Okay. Uh, what was the other thing I needed? A 2 by 2 iron plate. So that's going to take 4. That's alright. We have plenty. Um, and now I think we just need the work table. I don't think you need to sharpen a hammer. I don't think. Tools, hammer, one iron plate and one wood. Uh oh. Back out of this. Oh, I need to see it again. Okay, the top one and the middle one. So this should make... Oh no. This should make one... Yeah, I think purple might mean handmade. By me. This should make a hammer. I feel like I'm gonna want my own hammer as well, aren't I? Could make another one. Let's just... I guess we're in the demo, so we should just follow what we've been told for now. In the main game, it sounds like you would want to make all your own tools, right? Uh, and they're never going to come in wrong since they have durability. I think I should put this down here. And maybe this since I can't wear it. Like that. And this is like a commission, so let's put that there. I don't know. Oh, bollocks. So now we need to make nails. Crafting? No? Yeah, set of nails. Three iron sharpened strips right along the middle. Just like that. I wonder if you can automate this kind of stuff eventually. I'm guessing probably not, but like thinking how a long way into Porsche, you can start automating some stuff a little bit. Uh, let's see. 
my time at Porsche, by the way, in case you're wondering what the hell I'm talking about when I say Porsche. Uh, the, the game. Right, a set of nails and some hammers. Well, a hammer and some nails. Travel east past the mountains to reach Strom and deliver the tools to Myrtle. We're delivering them personally ourselves. We're not only a blacksmith, we're also a courier. I mean, I do like adventure. Let's go. East over the hills? Oh, I guess these are the hills. Cool, let's go up then. Get out of my way, tree. Aha. Oh, I love this. This is great. Myrtle we're looking for. Myrtle? Uh, you attacking me? I think this person... is this a child? Okay, I should stop walking backwards and forwards. They're chasing... oh no they're not. <laughs> Myrtle! Oh. Hmm, there's an old piece of paper stuck in the debris. Looks like an old request from a woodworker for a new tool. Oh, this is the thing we're repairing. Myrtle! I can definitely make something with that. Okay, we can <laughs> pick up an old order from the broken order table. Luca, have you come for my order? Hi! Uh, I am. I mean, I have. That's a big axe you have there, Myrtle. I am pleased. My crew will have the notice board fixed in no time. It's time to get some orders posted again. Great. I'll be ready to fulfill them. While you wait for us to repair the notice board, you should go talk to Splinter. That little boy seemed very eager to talk to you. Oh, the one that was chasing me? Thanks for the info. I'll go see how I can help. Splinter that child? I hope so, because I've walked all the way back here. Excuse me, Mr. Blacksmith. Hello there, what can I do for you? I I was wondering if you can make a super amazing knight's helm? I got my sword, but I want a helmet like Ash got from his dad, as closely to his as possible. Can you make sure to look at Ash's helm? I really want it the exact same. Exact same, huh? I'll do my best. Is that okay though? Because that's just like I was gonna say plagiary. Is that is that a word? Forgery, plagiarism. Is plagiarism what I'm looking for? You know, it's copying. Uh, okay. I mean, I guess anything goes in public. Are you Ash? Hey, Ash. Maybe you can help me figure this out. Sure. What's up? Splinter wants me to make him a helmet. He specifically asked for one like yours. Could I take a look at it so I know what to model it after? I can do better. I've got the old schematic that Tavasta made for my dad years ago. Thanks, you just made my job super easy. Oh, brilliant. Okay, I guess he doesn't mind then. I just thought if it was, you know, a bespoke design, copying it might not be the best thing. So, Iron Adzi. Is Kamaik showing you? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, like a sickle or a scythe? Mm, a small one. <clears throat> Iron Kettle Helm. Oh, that is a bucket. That's a bucket hat. Okay. Oh, we can make that. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. Uh, back out. So, I guess I need to go home. I should walk through the rest of the village just in case there's anything else. I didn't make it all the way to the end. Oh, so this is like a wood... Oh, what's it called? Like a loggery. That's not what it's called, but... You know, a wood mill, maybe? You come to one in Skyrim when you've been playing. You go to that first village. And that's the place I've always been like, oh, I would love to live there. And it's got this big wood mill thing. Sawmill, maybe? Uh... Do you want to leave the scene? Yes, please. Let's go and get cracking. 
Oh, but while we're here though, I just felt like it would be rude not to, you know? We should see what's here. Then we can do more orders at once and deliver them together. It's just efficiency. Seriously? One side is burnt and the other side is raw. Absolutely not. Oh god, please, someone free me of this burnt nightmare. Stop moving! <coughs> I'm too slow. Hey, is everything alright? Couldn't help but notice you seem upset. It's it's my squirrel friend. No, I'm not alright. And yes, I'm upset. I can't stop thinking about my delicious idea. Flapjack. Dessert for breakfast. A flat cake covered in delicious sweet syrup. Fried in a pan with buttery goodness. Wow, you're making me hungry. Alas, I need to cook both sides, but I can't flip it with my spoon. Oh, I've got the tool for you. Did I ever make a spatula? I, or I found one? I might have found a schematic. Uh, alas, my creation breaks. It's too round. I need something flat and wide. Me and my idea are starving for the right tool. I can help with that. I'll come back when I forge what you need. See? It was such a good idea coming here. Okay, I didn't actually find a spatula, so... No second-hand spatulas for Flapjack. <clears throat> okay, let's now... See how much energy we have when we get home and start making things. I think we kind of reached the end of what looked accessible. Uh oh. Found another thing. Hello, ox? Friend? Are you okay? I should head back after this door 100%. Moo. Oh, poor Mr. Ox. How did you get so stuck, buddy? Here, if I cut these, it should free you. Moo. Oh, what happened? How did that happen? It worked. Are you hungry? You can join me for a campfire. I've got marshmallows. Moo. Moo. What's a marshmallow? Oh my. Come on then, you're gonna love them. So, I wonder if this replenishes our energy. It's nice to have some company for a change. I am so here for Ox Friend. Don't get me wrong, I'm grateful for Dry Stan and the Lumberjacks, but if I'm being honest, ever since I left home, I've been lonely. Mo? Oh? I left my old life behind to see if I can make a name for myself as a blacksmith, become a master, have a legacy. Blacksmithing is my passion, and I really like helping people with it. I couldn't do that back home. Moo. Moo. No, I can't say I ever tried grass chewing, but I'm glad you found your passion too. Snacks, man. They're, they're good. Hey, buddy. I've been thinking. How about you join us in Stal? Moo! 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 Awesome! I'll make sure you have a nice place to stay. You can make your way to the village in the morning and I'll see you there. Amazing! We're gathering friends for our village. How's our energy now? Oh, did you leave your cart behind? I mean, that's okay. Did the ox have a name? Was it even an ox? We gotta go and see them. Oh, we can get past now. My energy is indeed replenished. Oh, this bridge needs fixing. I'm not a blacksmith, I'm a bridge fixer. By order of the lumber chief, Myrtle, this bridge is off limit. How come it's off limit? The bridge is damaged, it's too dangerous to cross. I'm a blacksmith, maybe I can help. Back away, citizen! Oh, okay. Maybe we need to talk to Myrtle about the bridge? <laughs> yeah, we're just not allowed. Denied. I guess we need to finish helping Myrtle's citizens. 
uh, before we gain trust to be able to repair the bridge. I wonder if there's many secrets around, like in this corner here. And I don't know if we could have interacted with this, like, surfboard area. Right, is my ox buddy here? That's the most important question. Looking. Wait, that splinter is enough. Oh, hello. Oh, I can give some goggles. <laughs> hi. Oh, it won't let me say hi. Oh, am I pressing the wrong button? Oh no. Oh dear. Okay, okay, I had to press F. <laughs> Boo. Okay, I don't think I want to give you a present that's not like something suitable. We should check what we need to make. A spatula. Oh, I wondered why that one was ticked as if we did it, but... Night in the making. Oh, I have to hold it to be able to see it. Weird. Uh, forge an iron helmet. Okay, that's right. The bucket helmet. And the spatula. Right, that's fine. Uh, well, now I need to look at the recipes, don't I? So, the helm, two two by ones, a two by two, and a curved plate, and then a spatula. Spatula isn't a tool. There it is. Two iron strips and an iron plate, one by one. Right, let's see if I remember all of that. I don't think we'll have enough ingots. Right, we need one iron strip. Oh no, I missed. So inefficient. There we go. One iron strip. One two by two. Uh, two two by ones. Alright, we are starting to run out, so oh bollocks, we're gonna need to do some smelting. Uh one curved iron plate. Is that everything? Oh look, and then we can get that all in one. Oh, we can't. <laughs> I thought we could. There we go. Um That might have been everything. Right, so the helm is like this. I should double check just to be sure. Yeah. Hold E to assemble. Ta-da! I guess I can't wear things if I... Maybe there's no combat. Uh... Spatula. I needed a one by one. Not curved, just regular. Oh dear. There we go. Thought that was going to take me all day. And then the spatula was like, wasn't it just one and one? Oh, it was two. Well, thankfully, the recipe made me three anyway, so. Uh, assemble! I thought we had another thing. The helm. Oh, the notice board. No, yeah, we found something on the notice board, but I guess they maybe didn't want it to be made. Let me take a look. There's an iron something that I didn't know the name. 
I don't know what the deal with that was. Oh, here, it was this. Yes, yes. Should I maybe make one of those? No, not yet. Right. Return to Flapjack. Oh, I wish I could ride my ox friend. On the world map. I mean, I should use my own legs. Trying to think the most efficient. I don't think it much matters. Uh oh, maybe I shouldn't have gone out with such less energy. Because mm. that's just going to keep going down. I think we should be able to do both. Depends on how much energy we spend walking around this place. Splinter, where you at? Why aren't you here to greet me? Oh, hold on. Hold on. Splinter, come back. <coughs> Mr. Smith, Mr. Smith, do you have a helmet? Uh, um, is there a brave knight in need of a super awesome helm? Me, me! I want to be the brave knight. Whoa, this is awesome. Let's do tradesies. I take the helm and this is for you. It's instructions to make a tool that I call the sweater maker. Oh, and Myrtle wanted me to tell you that the... Uh, I forgot. No, wait, I remember. <laughs> it's about the notice board. It's repaired. I remember, because I even saw some people posting jobs for it already. For you already. And because it's like right behind me here. We're looking at it. In case you haven't already seen it. <laughs> Thanks, Splinter. You're a sweet kid. Uh... Knitting needles, okay. Cool, I can make those. Right. Oh, see, an order of knitting needles. And then, oh nice. So this, this is Porsche-esque. Uh, you can choose what you want to do, what you got the resources for, and what prizes you might want. So we should maybe prioritize this pan so that we can get a new blueprint. And like things that we might not find very much in the wild, like this thing, this flamed wood. Uh, hold on though, because if I double check, how do I make this? Oh yeah, I can make that easy. So yeah, I don't know if we can only take one at a time. It's gone! Oh, it's here. It just moved. <laughs> Psyched me out. I've taken both. Wait, we could just do all of these. We could be so rich. Hmm. Let's just do the two for now. Oh, I found a beer cart. Look at the size of that keg. Marrow? Like, giant marrow? And Mel doesn't want to talk to us. Let's... I think we have enough energy to run to the... Oh, we could have made like a more direct path. I think that would take more energy. Yeah, we still have over half. Behold, a spatula. Huzzah! Finally, I get to taste my sweet, sweet invention. Mom would be proud. I must use it right away. A round of flapjacks flat cakes on me. Stop by any time for an energy boost. Oh, cool. All right. Uh... Old fashioned pancakes. Is that what he was making? Pancakes? I didn't really register the recipe that he was using. But it could be pancakes. Uh, crepes. Fluffy pancakes. Right. I, I had pancakes for breakfast, actually. Uh, we already looked around here and there was nothing else, was there? Hey, nice to help you, thingy. Oh, we're supposed to complete three orders. And I only picked up two. <laughs> Whoops. Do I have enough energy? <laughs> I'm like, let's be efficient. But also, let's forget to do things on the way. I think we should be okay. We've still got half. Why is the notice board so far into this village? 
Put it on the outskirts to be convenient for me. I can make a hatchet. What are the kind of rewards would I like? I might as well make... Oh. Well, I can't even make a horseshoe or a bu bucket yet. I can make a bucket helm. Uh, we could make this as well. Just to get the extra money. Uh, even though it said do three, we can do four. I'm an overachiever, what can I tell you? <laughs> uh, let's go, baby. I just want to make it home without falling asleep. And then I would like to level up and see what happens. So we will actually just go to sleep when we make it back. There's these upgrades as well, I keep forgetting, but... They're just either locked or ticked, I don't know. <clears throat> we could go and make some stuff, but I'm just gonna sleep. That's why I wanted to level up. Oh god dang, we le leveled up so much. We met so many characters. What on earth was that coming out of our face? I think it was snores. Right, we got some absolute crafting to do today. Let's do these four orders, take them back. And then that's probably when we'll be calling it a day. I imagine after doing those, we'll get to repair the bridge. Um. Uh-oh. This is where my memory gets tested. Um. A pan, knit needles, a hatchet, and adzi. Let's see. We can do the pan and the needles, right? A strip and a two by two. Two strips. And shot and okay, so four strips, five strips, a two by two, five strips and a two by two. Start with that. Oh god. Strips. And then I need to do some smelting. Oh god, no, don't don't smelt my thingies. Alright, I don't Was there a way that I can do like half of these? It's like what if I need all? I don't think I'm gonna need all. Let's just smelt it all. How long is this gonna take? It's not bad. Like this part of it has a little bit of a feeling of spirit fairer. But I'm liking this more so far. It's a little bit faster than spirit fairer I find. Um, so I'm getting like vibes of a lot of different games that I like. Oh, um, I wonder if maybe I don't have to do this entire thing right now because this is going to take forever <coughs> i wonder if i can cancel it because that's like 40 odd ingots i think that's going to do the job oh you know what i can just i don't need to be doing this now how do i let go there we go i can just let it go can't i and i can do what i need to do now i need my two by two. Oh, can i not take these yeah thank you Oh, I can cancel it. Nice. Oh, this is great. It's got like a lot of like little ease of use things. It feels like it's been play tested and adjusted and stuff. Uh... Right. Um, let's see then. I need to sharpen two of the rods. Oh, freak. 
I don't know what happens if you fail. Did it work? Yeah, I got my two. Alright, so that's... I guess I should just make them. Be good if you could, like, uh, pin these onto your screen somehow. Uh... Right, the bottom corner. Blunt and then sharp. Like that. That should make us some knitting needles. And then the pan is just the the bowl. I like also that it does correspond to like it makes sense. These recipes make sense. So like this big plate is to make the bowl and then that's the handle. This is very nicely put together. Oops. Right. Two down, two to go. What? What's the other thing I needed to do? Uh, iron hatchet and iron adazi. I don't know that word. I've never heard of it before. Adzi. So a sharp and curved plate. That's a very pickaxe-y, I guess. And... A 2 by 2 iron sharpened plate. Hold on, 2 by. 2 No, no, they wanted... Oh, did they want a hatchet or an axe? <laughs> a hatchet! Alright, hold on. Oh wait, it's still a 2 by 2 iron sharpened plate. Okay. And then this is a 1 by 2 curved sharpened plate. Alright, because we have 1 by 1s as well. Oh no! I don't know how to make a 2 by 2 thing yet. I'm only going to be able to make... One of them. I don't know which one though. Oh, can I like... Oh, I can just put them in my pocket. Thank you. <clears throat> so this one I can make a one by two curved chop and plate right just one. Oh, that was so fast speedy that one fell faster than the others <laughs> uh then sharpen it and then assemble. I can't believe that I made a mistake on this game. The one where it tells you what to press and you just press it. Did this one only need one wood? What am I making? This. That looks like that to me. Let's see. Looks good. Yeah, my axe is getting low. I gotta remember when I'm out um, exploring, cutting down trees. I will need to take spare axes if it's getting too low. Okay, well that's my three, right? <clears throat> I'm gonna have to... Maybe one of them will give me the blueprint for that. I can sprint! I didn't know. Or maybe these upgrades are what lets me do that for make more base materials. I wonder if there's going to be new metals as well. I assume there will be since everything is very specifically iron here. Wait, how do I give people their stuff? How do I know who they are? Hoping I just drop it off. Oh, oh! Friends, stop running away from me. Friend! Here's the aim you requested. Thanks, here's your payment. Nice. Okay, I'm earning money and firewood. Here's the aim you requested. 
Thanks, here's your payment. Oh, that was Ash. The blueprint. What did I get? Knitting needles! I already know knitting needles! That's rude. Worst payment ever. So then... Journal... Who is this... Um, sorry, this one for? Birch. We're looking for Birch. Hold on. Uh, in Strom. Is this Strom? Or is my home Strom? Oh, okay. It's you. It's you. Here's the item. Thanks. Here's your payment. I did it. Myrtle. I done it. You, Luca, I must ask for your assistance again. Me? <laughs> hey, Myrtle, how can I help? Do you recall the monstrous storm that hit a few nights ago? I heard Drysand talking about it, but we weren't impacted by it in Stahl. Okay, Stahl is where we're from. It has damaged our bridge that gives us access to the north. I ha And I have a lumber shipment for beet that's passed too. We would be grateful if you'd go repair the bridge. I'm sorry to hear it's causing you trouble. I'll take care of it right away. But is your guard gonna let us see the bridge though? <laughs> Head northwest of this village. If you get lost, I map the location on your map. You'll have to clear a path. It would be foolish to forget an axe and a knife before going. I need a knife? Thanks for the tip. I'll make sure to remember it. I didn't take a knife last time, but you don't have forging facilities here. Okay, I'm gonna run back to the bridge because <clears throat> I might need to run home again. Oh, hey, what are you doing here? Merle told me to install this equipment for you to make things more easily. Wasn't much fun dragging it here, but I respect her too much to say no. Thank you, that's really convenient. It's gonna save me a lot of time now I can make things on site. Indeed. I was also ordered to give you these. Wood I gathered personally and all specially ordered from the Malima miners for this job. Before you ask, yes, my back is killing me. You just go down south and buy some pancakes. I think that will make you feel better. No, I have not had a chance to rest. I'll send you a bill from my masseuse. Send it to Merle, not me. Hmm. I wouldn't be able to pay for that, but I can get the bridge fixed in no time. It was worth a try. One more thing. I've been tinkering do during my free time. I thought you didn't have free time. And I came up with designs for some tools. Maybe as a blacksmith, it'll serve you well. Thank you. To repair this bridge, you'll need to fix the two holes. You can jump over them, but careful not to fall in the water. Oh, we'll totally die. Right, so many ingots. Blueprints. Are they bridge parts? Oh, screws and bolts. Hinges. Okay. Thank you. You designed hinges in your spare time? Hey, how do I fix the bridge exactly? Willow, that's them. You've got to use your blacksmithing skills and fix these holes. So we got... This, this, and this. We don't have the smelter, though. <coughs> right. A <coughs> set of nails and a chain. I can do that. A set oh, and wood, and wood. Yeah, yeah. I was like, how is a set of nails and a chain gonna make that? Are we gonna make a tightrope across it? Uh, okay. So now we need to go into our codex. Uh, or it would be good if we could pin recipes and then it could tell us maybe as a little thing here what we need to make something like that chain five times iron curved plate one by one okay one by one and then already forgotten what i need set of nails Three 
iron sharpened strips. I only have two, okay. So five one by one curved plates. Easy. Oh no! <laughs> Sometimes my fingers just get away from me. Nice. So now we can make a chain. And we need just one set of iron strips. But we do need to sharpen them. Uh, how many? Was it three? Yeah, it was three. That should be all we need. If I've calculated correctly. And I believe the nails is just like that. Yeah. And then the chain is like... Alright, I'll try and remember that. Um... Assemble! Oh, this bridge is so easy to fix. I'm gonna fly through it. Let's do it. Oh no, I need so many more nails. <laughs> I need to do that again twice. It's okay. We can do it. We can we can do it. So, 6. We don't need to go home to to sleep. I guess that's why the pancake man is down south so that we don't have to go home. We could just go and buy pancakes. Eternal energy. Six of these. It's nice that you only have to do the mini game once, even if you're doing a big batch. And then it said you can stack to make multiples, so I'm gonna try this. Did it work? Wait, I got so many stacks of- Oh yeah, no, 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 that's right, because I already had one. Yeah, yeah. Hey! Okay, I know there's a second one. Okay, I do think we're gonna have to run home at some point. Damn it. Okay, let's run home. Oh, hold on, hold on, because we can jump across, can't we? Let's just go and see what's ahead here. No, 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 accident! Stop! No, I wanted to shake the tree. It gave me the option to use my hands when I pressed F instead of D. Oh, oh. Oh, I'm punching it. Oh, God, that's... <laughs> Not what I meant at all. I thought I was going to shake some apples down or something. I can't believe I just punched that tree to death. Okay, I guess that's in case we needed some more wood. But I mean, I'm gonna have to pop home to sleep. But then we can come back. Let's do that before we finish up. Surely that's probably gonna get us towards the end of the demo anyway. Why are you running to me? I can never tell if people are running at me or just going for a jog. But when it's night time, you don't expect to see people jogging at you. This might give us another level up, whatever that does for us. Aspiring three. <laughs> Aspiring the third. Right. We got this so much. Let's go. Was that thingy bird just smoking on a pipe just there? Capstan. Can't remember names. Well, it wasn't Flapstan. That was Flapjack. <laughs> Dry stun. Did it need two two by twos? I think it needed two two by twos. So let's do two two by twos.
not nuts and bolts. Nails and bolts? Screws and bolts? Screws and bolts. One strip, two one by one curved plates. I think I'll have a spare strip so we can do two one by one curved plates. There we go. And then chains again, right? So we need five of these. So we could have just done seven, but never mind. Unless that's not what we just made. I don't know that I'm doing this with maximum efficiency, but it's fine. Screw optimization. We're winging it. Uh, so chain. Screws and bolts. None of them is sharpened, so... Right, I do remember how to make a chain. I think this was just like that or something. Let's check it out and see. Oh, there was two of those. Oh, that that was not at all it. It was <laughs> two of these. <laughs> not even close. All right, let's see if I have everything I need here, or if I've just completely butchered it. <laughs> right, four iron plates, not two. And two more sets of screws and bolts. I can do that. We have the resources. We would have spent less energy if I'd been more efficient, but... That's alright. Energy's overrated. I'm still gonna need more strips. Just just one set, but Ah, oh, hanging on by a thread. Right. Um Nothing needed sharpening, did it? Just I haven't made the goddamn curves. But I'm gonna need four curves. Yeah, I could have done this oh my god, if I'd actually counted it out. Probably could have done it all in one day if I just counted it out. You're not even attached anymore. What are you talking about? Okay. Uh, now. I got this. Right. That should be two screws and bolts. So I should end up with three. Three right here. Yeah, boy. Let's go. We did it! Oh, the trees grew back so quickly. So going to sleep grows them back. Oh, we're gonna have to speak with Myrtle at the bridge. She's here! <clears throat> hey, Luca, this looks perfect. Thank you, you'll definitely be able to deliver beet shipment now. Yes, and you should go that way too. I'm sure a beet will love if you check in on him. That's a good idea. We've sent something to Stal for you. A gesture of our gratitude and for all your help. With it, you'll be able to explore the island more easily. I'll go check it out now. Thank you so much. It is my pleasure. What did you send me? Another ox? Maybe it's like a... Oh, like a paragliding... <laughs> like, wings? <laughs> oh, maybe it's a boat. We do have a beach. Where's my gift? Show me my gift. Dry stun. Oh, hey, dry stun. I just finished up fixing up the lum lumberjack's bridge just north of here. That answers why the lumberjack delivered this broken cart. It will be worth fixing up for the real surprise. Right, and what do you think I should do with our new ox friend? Whoa, not our. Yours. I don't want to be expected to pick up any drop-ins. Yuck. Hey, that's good fertilizer, that is. Put it on the gardens. 
It's gonna need a stable. I've written all the resources you'll need to build it on the design table by your house. Oh, stables. With the cart repaired and the stable for the ox built, you'll be able to travel Ilian much more f effectively. Cool. I'm gonna take a look at this. Stables. <coughs> oh my god, we can probably make that really easily, actually. <laughs> Should I do that before we go? No, I can't keep... Oh, but I gotta give my ox a home. We have the stuff. I ha Wait, hold on. We can do this efficiently. Six sets of nails. Two hinges. What do we need for hinges? Because we've never made those. Okay. Sharp and strip. We're doing it. We have energy, we're home. Let's see then. Four one by ones to start with. It's so satisfying making things in bulk. Um, so for the hinges, we need two iron sharpened strips, but for the nails, we need three and we need six. So six times three. Here we go. Six, twelve, eighteen. Right? Eighteen and then two. Twenty. We need twenty strips. How many do we have? We have two. We need eighteen strips. Three. Why have I times them all together? I've done this three. <laughs> What's eighteen divided by three? Six? No. Eighteen divided by six is three. Wait. Do I need to press this six times? 18. There we go. I think that's right. <laughs> that was some new maths for you all. Right? And then... Do they all need to be sharpened? Keep pressing on the wrong things. Sorry. All sharpened. That's alright. That's not gonna take any effort at all. Oh, we can do this so quickly, actually. I just need to double check that this is certainly the recipe for... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So... I think these need to be six each. And that should leave us with two. Oh no! <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> okay, we would be able to do this quickly if we sharpened 20 and we already sharpened one. <laughs> no effort at all this will take. I can't figure out how to get them all in there. The F, there we go. <laughs> we get there! We'd have had it all done by now. <sighs> right. Nails. So many nails. Let me make my hinges. I've even remembered this off the top of my head. How to make two sets of hinges at once. Look at this bad boy. Do we still have ten ingots left? We do. Right. Stable time for my ox friend. I can't wait. Is it going to be here right next to my house? Oh, it's shaking because it's so exciting. Right. Travel north and continue exploring the island. Where's my stables? Oh, is this it? Oh, oh, I thought it was treasure. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> oh, mobile forge upgrades. That's what the cart is in mobile forge. Oh, that's cool. Well, that's good. Does it have a bed in it, though? <clears throat> All right. Um, we don't actually need to upgrade it. Oh, this is... Okay, okay. 
Oh, my buddy. I love my friend. Best character in the game. Right, let's sleep. And then let's take it out. We need to know what it's like to take it out, right? We've put all this effort into making it. We need to go on a road trip with our buddy. Whoa. We yeeted through another level there. Let's go. Get me in my cart. Oh wow, I spent so much of my money, but... Worth it. We could always do, um, thingies, commissions, right? I just don't think my ox would enjoy getting some goggles. Oh, I think I just need to leave. Hey, cart and camp, hold the interaction button to set up your camp. This will allow you to forge items on the go. Hold the what? Oh, I... Turned it off too quick. Where's my ox? My ox is invisible. Oh, here we go then. Oh, hi! My chickens! Oh, they must be so scared. Why? What's going on? Well, last night a bunch of miscreants thought it'd be funny to hide them throughout my farm. These sneaky guys are getting back at me for not giving them my great-great-great-great-grandfather's secret. You live in a hobbit house! It's supp Oh no, is that the chicken house? It's supposed to open a hidden treasure, but I've never found it. And now this? My poor chickens. I think I can help save your chickens and find your treasure. I'll help. What do you need me to do? Well, can you please go around my gut? Uh, farm and guide my five chickens back to their pen east of the property. You got it. Thank you. Are these chicken houses little hobbit homes? Is this the pen? Okay. We are using energy slowly, so... That's good. Which way is east? Yeah, this way. Are you kidding? Get out of my way, Rock! Wow. Oh. Wow. Well, that's gonna get in the way. Oh, nice! I know what to do. Oh, this is good! Chicken. Don't worry, you're safe now. I'll kick the people's ass who did this to you. I do have a pickaxe after all. That's a good ass kicking weapon. <gasps> Is this a female ox? <laughs> hey bud, what are you doing behind that tree? <laughs> Oh, I see. Yes, she seems very nice. You should say hi. <gasps> oh my god. This is the cutest thing. Moo. How about you go give her some flowers? Oh, you can do it. I'm sure she's gonna love you. Moo? Moo. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. No hands makes that difficult. I can make a bouquet if you want. Moo! Slow down, alright. So I need a snowbell, a pansy, a misty morning glory. Do they all grow in the region? Moo. Alright, I'll find them, make a bouquet and bring it back. <gasps> this is the cutest quest I've ever been given. Bouquet of flowers. Look at this. That looks like a blue lemon. Okay. Oh man, can I say hello? I can't. Oh, this is so cute. I think it was love at first sight. Get out of my way, Rock. I got chickens to save. Uh oh. Yeah. He said five, right? That's so... 
still two more somewhere. I don't know how far this goes. What is this? Music? I've just seen some treasure. A music shrine? Okay, well, hold on. I found one of my flowers. Which one is this? A pansy. Colorful garden flower can be used to make a bouquet. <coughs> okay. Uh, so here, we gotta fix the instruments? I don't know how to make metal string yet. Cool, string instruments though. Oh, this is really cool. There's all these little neat things on the map. I just think this is great. Oh god, okay. Maybe once I've given the chickens back, they'll give me the code for the grandpa's treasure. Oh! Double chickens! Hold on. That one was just hidden there in plain cloud sight. Like, I've just gone around it. I really like this game, guys. It's so good. Like, it keeps giving me different things that I'm not expecting. It's really engaging. Hey, all of your chicken are back in the pen. Thank you so much. Since you've helped my beloved chickens, maybe the secret is better in your hands. Yeah, give me that secret. Your grandpas, are you sure? Yeah, it's only a matter of time before the sneaky society steals it from me. Oh, I am an honorary sneaky society because I killed one of their members and all that. <laughs> but at least that's what I'm telling people happened. I'd rather a good person like you have it. Plus, something tells me this treasure will serve you better. Thank you so much for your help. Well, I'm just glad the chickens are safe, that's all. Wait, so what is it then? Tell me the secret. Ovial. Okay, I mean, there's only four characters, so... I feel like we could brute force it if people weren't willing to give me their, like, family heirlooms. Ovial. Metal string! We can fix the instruments and we can we can do that by setting up camp, right? Because we have our forge and stuff now. Metal string. Three iron bars. Uh a scythe. Okay, this is more like a scythe. A shield. I don't know why we're getting swords and shields. Oh dang, we're getting so much enchanted wood. Grumps enchanted wood. Oh, we can't stack tools. I guess that makes sense. Makes a sense. Got a well? Oh, well, is there like some secret? Oh, do I need metal string? Oh no, the secret tunnels! A rat king! Well, a rat rogue? Maybe? Hello? Another one? Alright, that's it. Porgy? I swear, if another one of you little bipeds falls down here trying to take back your coin, I'm gonna have to close up for good. Excuse my barging in. I don't want any trouble. My name is Luca. Who are you? Haha, <laughs> no trouble. Not possible. Why? See, Trouble is my middle name. Waha. Poggy Trouble Mouse. Uh, why do I bother? I'm not actually good at being the bad guy. It just doesn't come naturally to me. The name's Poggy, and my lair you broke into is supposed to be a secret. Yeah, here you are. If you're not such a bad guy, why do you act like it and hide in a secret lair? Well, I never said I was an angel or a hero material, but I do steal from time to time. So you are a bad guy. You don't get it. There's nothing better to do. I would be nothing without stealing. There's definitely better things to do than stealing. Don't you have a hobby? I used to. You know what really lights my fire? What inspires me? Where I find the most fulfillment? No, but the anticipation's killing me. Knitting! 
Oh, it's like singing a sweet melody. Stitch two, pearl one. Stitch two, pearl one. Isn't your brain tingling at the sound of that? All of those needles clicking together? But I've only been able to get my paws on wooden ones. My intricacy and talent has always been broken those has always broken those flimsy wooden needles. Every sweat and quilt I would start left unfinished. A tragedy. It has made my heart heavy and driven me to find joy along a darker path. <laughs> Amazing. Who am I? Let's start with a big deep breath. Okay, I'm a blacksmith. I can make you iron knit needles and those won't break. A blacksmith? Iron needles? Well now, that's interesting. Hmm, yes. I'll believe it when I see it. If you can bring me a pair of great knitting needles, I could forget thieving and go back to my true passion. You have a deal. I'll be back. Amazing. These characters are so good. It's so good. Right, knitting needles for you. String instruments for, well, strings for the instruments, I guess. Oh god, so good. Right. Let's just pop back to our card. Um, yeah, moving around is taking us so much less energy now. Oh god, I've just nearly bumped into a stealer. Was this the person that did the chickens? Hold on. I mean, I think we should murder him. <clears throat> Ooh, I am curious, or how we say it. It's armor. That's so much iron. Definitely doable. Ooh, a green berry. Uh, can be gifted to friends. From a land far west. So now we have goggles and a hat. And a great sword. Oh god, what have I done? Oh, can I just right click on this? A large two handed sword used by less wealthy mercenaries. A metal bucket! We needed that for something. Oh, a commission, wasn't it? And a spear. Alright. Uh, I didn't realise we could just right click. That's so much easier. And now we're rich again as well. Well, I guess we should deal with this guy. Oh my god, I just can't stop playing. What are you doing to that horse? Oh, a flower. That's not even one of the flowers I need, is it? Excuse me, are you alright? Oh man, I was in full-blown getaway mode after I got caught stealing little kid socks. <laughs> I turn them into tiny evil sock puppets and we do performances for other members sometimes. This is sneaky Kyle. But anyway, my dong my my dong <laughs> Oh no, that's a different very different story. My dang's horse my dang horse's shoes broke. <laughs> and I'm far too I'm too far from camp to replace them. I'm as stuck as stuck gets. They were last my last set of horseshoes too. Oh, so you just need horseshoes? I can make those for you. Oh yeah? I can't pay for them though. Well, you're in a difficult position, so I'm happy to help you out. This one's on me. You don't understand. I would need to, to steal them from you. Otherwise I'm just a normal guy buying horseshoes. Oh, I see. Well, I'll tell everyone I know that you stole them. Fine, that works. Here's a schematic. I've designed great horseshoes and Muffin won't wear anything else. Muffin. Got it. I'll reproduce these. Is Muffin's your horse? Muffin is my diabolical steed. When you return with four horseshoes, Muffins and I will show you just how fast full speed is. Muffin. Can I pet Muffin? No. Oh. Is that a helmet on the floor? Okay, well, sneaky Kyle. Not as... Not as bad as I thought. Full horseshoes. Did I use the schematic, though? A one-by-one one curve and two thingies. We can do that. I feel like I've missed a flower somewhere as well. 
Uh, right. How do I? How do I get my camp out though? I skipped too fast over the button that told me how to come. Oh yeah, I still owe someone a hatchet. Blown tires is the horseshoes. Career change is the knitting needle. Oh no, I don't know how to make my cum. I'll try just pressing some buttons for a bit. F, it's F. Right. Oh, that's good. I guess that's how I get off as well if I just want to walk. Oh, my flowers! <clears throat> oh, I also have a crate. A full on bed. Look at this camp! Hold on then, what's this stuff? Well, this is how I upgrade my cum. A campfire. Just to make it cozy. Right. Let's make sure we get this book here, right? Because this is the most important part. We've got three things we're going to do before we finish, okay? We're going to uh, make the book here, take it to the ox. Make the knitting needles and make the horseshoes. And then we're done. I tell you, done. Okay, blue, purple, white. Blue, purple, white. Please tell me I didn't get that wrong. Good. How do we then make horseshoes? I know how to make knitting needles. Oh yeah, yeah. Right, knitting needle. Okay, so I need four strips there. Oh god. I need four horseshoes, so that means I need eight strips there. So I need 12 strips in total. 12 strips and four plates. Twelve strips. Oops, missed. Twelve strips, four plates. Please tell me I have enough. Oh yeah, I have plenty. And then two of the strips need to be sharpened. There's such a danger of this mini game having my fingers on the wrong buttons. I do that all the time. Oh, my ox. Uh, wow, is this a smelter? I have a smelter too here? Brilliant. Okay. Um, knitting needles is like this. Now, the strips on the horseshoes definitely weren't sharpened, were they? No. Good. So we're going <clears throat> make these in bulk. Oh, I got it wrong. What did I do wrong? <laughs> oh, they gotta be curved. Damn it. <laughs> oh, what a dingus. Okay, let's do... We got this. <laughs> Why wouldn't it be curved? It's a goddamn horseshoe. Right, this should be it. I'm glad it didn't take my resources from me for getting it wrong. Right, we got our four horseshoes. We got our bouquet, we got our knitting needles. Let's go, ox. We don't even need to sleep. Oh, is this so we can make marshmallows? Oh, whoops. I tried to make marshmallows, but I blew it out. We can actually just leave that there.
Here you go, full hot shoes for Muffin. Mwah, Muffin, you and I are out of here. Here's a reward, Blacksmith. Just a note? Just a note? <coughs> That's another one of my grand designs. A way for you to make a magnificent weapon. It's priceless. Thanks, I guess. What is it? No, 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 I didn't get, no, don't, no, don't take it away from me. I wanted, to, <laughs> I was so ready to give knit needles to a rat and a flower bouquet to an ox. That's so sad. I really like this game. <laughs> Can you tell? Uh, all right. Oh! Oh, thank you! Why did you do that to me, game? Zero out of ten. Don't like anymore. <laughs> oh, yay! I guess that... Thank you for playing more adventures of Wait You. So this is basically saying you've done it. You can free play if you want, but you're done. But we're not done. Because this is important. Finish the bouquet. It looks beautiful. You choose the flowers well. No, no. You want me to give it to them? No. Anything for you, buddy. I'm doing it? Okay. Hey! My handsome and single ox friend over there wanted me to give you this. I'm being an absolute wingman. No? No! Oh no! Allergies? I'm sorry, it's just traditionally such a foolproof gesture. This was my idea. My friend here really just wants you to know he thinks you're pretty awesome. Moo! Oh no! Oh, that was so bad. Oh, it became like a reef? I'm sorry, buddy. Seems like she was allergic and didn't like them. Moo. It's okay, you're a great friend and there's plenty of cows in the fields. Oh, that's so sad. I'm so sorry. A crown. It gave us a flower crown. I thought it was going to be happily ever after. Is she back? She's gone forever. Okay. Knit needles, final one. And then we're done. Oh, there is also the string instruments, but I'm not going to do that. We gotta leave something for people to be able to do themselves, right? Rat friend! Are you backpack hero? You look very backpack hero y. Pogster? Don't, the name's Poggy. Right, sorry. I made your knitting needles. Oh my... Oh my. Dare I touch such beautiful craftsmanship with tainted criminal paws? <gasps> Why? I must be dreaming. <coughs> sorry, I nearly... <laughs> I nearly... <laughs> I shouldn't have inhaled like that. <coughs> Why? I must be dreaming. So, you don't like nicknames, but the knitting needles are a success. Your thieving days are behind you. Gladly. And take those coins too. I'm starting fresh. I'll take the dirty coins. Now get out. I need to get this place back in working order. Oh, are you gonna, like... Are you gonna do the place up with, like, knitting? What did I get? Oh, I already have an iron spear recipe. I got coins? Fine. I'm gonna go out and come back in again and see if anything happens. I imagine it's not the last we'll see of these characters. Um, in... Within the game? Let's go. I don't think there's gonna be anything different. But I do imagine in the main game, things might evolve. Oh, where are you going? Left! Completely gone. 
That's fine. There might be somewhere else in the world. They don't need a secret lair anymore now that they're not a thief. But I'm not going to go around looking for them. Uh... I do wonder if they do move on into new towns and stuff. I do wonder how big the game is going to be. Uh, we are finishing up here, so I'm going to be summarizing my thoughts. Yeah, I do wonder how big the game is going to be. I do wonder... I just... I just... I, well, I don't... There's not actually a lot that I wonder other than how long it's going to keep on... Uh, providing, like, joy around every corner because... So far, I feel like that is what they were going for, and that's what they've achieved as well. The exploration is so nice in a game like this. It's just really paired up some mechanics that I like in a way that I like. Uh, so I just... Yeah, this is like one of my favourites of this type of game that I've played on Indie Showcase, to be honest with you. Like, I'm just trying to think. It's like maybe my favourite. I really like it. Um... I just highly recommend. It feels good to play. It feels well paced. I feel like I could take a break if I wanted and just craft stuff if I want. Uh, but also, like, I would want to be working on those string instruments. Because, like, what the hell? Why are there just string instruments there? I don't know and I want to find out. Um, it's just given us all different things to do. And I really appreciate the, the craft that's gone into this game, actually. Because, like, it's a game about crafting. But it also feels exceptionally well crafted. So yeah, like this game releases, I believe, next week at the time of this video's release. Uh, or the week after, actually. I'm saying next week. Uh, I think it's the week after. Keep an eye out for it. Have a look at it on Steam. Give it a wishlist. Wishlist and always helps indie devs. Um, especially if you enjoyed it. And check it out. If you liked it, you could always buy it when it releases. Um, it's certainly going on my wish list anyway because I've had a great time with that. Uh, I hope that you guys enjoyed. If I'm, I'm trying to think of recommendations, but uh, it's just like I said, the kind of the mini game side of it, you get a little bit of that in Spirit Fairer. So I'll say Spirit Fairer. I'll say Porsche because Porsche is like kind of your Stardew Harvest Mooney type of game. That is focused around crafting rather than farming, which I find more engaging personally. Uh, although I do like, I absolutely love Sardew Valley, but I just prefer crafting to farming. I just think it's more fun, uh, a little less repetitive. So, and then I, it's reminded me of something with this exploration, but I can't put my finger on what it is. So I can't really suggest anything for that side of it. But um, I guess another, the other pixely kind of game that I played that's not really like this but a little bit was Roots of Pacha, which I also really enjoyed. But I think I like this more. This was a little more simple, I think. Like, I don't know if simple is the right word, but I felt more guided. Not guided, I felt more focused, that's the word. I felt more focused on what I wanted to do and there was always something where I was like bang bang I want to do this next thing I want to do this next thing um, and I think that is to the de to the devs credit to be honest that's very good pacing in my opinion um, so yeah I really hope you enjoyed that that was very nice and chill I'm really glad that we tried it out uh, and that is it for this week and therefore this month of Indie Showcase I'll see you next week with another game thank you so much for watching bye bye